New at 6 tonight, a proposal by the Trump administration could see thousands of families removed from federal housing programs, including hundreds right here in Arizona. The plan aims to crack down on undocumented immigrants, but as News 4 Tucson's Aliyah Shahid explains, immigrants with legal status could also be effect affected. A new proposal would bar families from public housing if any member of the household is undocumented. Undocumented immigrants are ineligible for benefits, but under current law can live with family members who have legal status. The head of the South Tucson Housing Authority says changing that rule doesn't make any sense. Rent for them uh, is prorated. They actually pay more than all U.S. citizens living in that house. Housing authorities are getting more money because of this, so they can't say it's costing anyone. Government analysis shows the plan could lead to the eviction of more than 100,000 people, many of them children. The children have to leave, and they're usually the ones who are the U.S. citizens. So now we're talking about their education, a roof over their head. HUD Secretary Ben Carson defended the plan, saying his department is trying to put American families first. So you're going to shift 55,000 children from being with their families uh, to then to a, a homeless status, uh, status. What's going to happen with these children? Have you thought this program through? Well, maybe what will happen with them is that you and Congress will do your job and solve the problem. Public comment on the plan will be accepted until July 9th. Aliyah Shaheed, News 4 Tucson.